Hello there, in this episode we are going to be talking about a camera shake that's constant in the game. Um, so let's get started. The first thing that you have to do is go to your star content blueprints folder. If you don't have any, make sure you create a new folder and um, right click blueprint class. Um, make sure this one's expanded. Type in camera shake. You have the camera shake base selected type in BP on the line. Um, so for the sake of this tutorial, I'm going to be calling it shake tutorial and then double click on it. For some reason, it opens up like this. Close it, open it up again, and then you have something here. Root shake pad pattern should be perlin noise. At least this is what I like most. Uh, in the rotation section, the amplitude multiplier should be one. Um, everything is just set to one, so we don't have any problem with that. Timing, the duration should be set to zero. It means that it's gonna, um, so if it's set to one, it means that it's going to be shaking the camera for one second. If it's set to zero, it's going to be shaking the camera infinitely. Hit compile, save, go to your um, blueprint character. If you don't know what that's, gonna look like just come in here in the world settings if you don't have a world settings make sure make sure come in here in the window tab uh, world settings just uh, click on it then in the default pawn class find it double click on it go into event graph um, in the event graph find the event begin play this one right here double click on it you'll find the event begin play go all the way down here if you haven't added anything you can just skip all the steps here and then type in camera manager get play camera manager then shake start camera shake right here then find the class you just created it's called shake tutorial i'm going to um disconnect this one for some reason you have to add a delay node as well otherwise it doesn't work so make sure you add these two and then connect them all in here so let's get um into the scene and see what we got we have a pretty good camera shake if we want to we can go ahead and uh change the scale to something like five to, i mean it just changed to three um uh, and then we have a more clear camera shake which isn't good to be honest it will make you sick make the, make the player sick so i would say uh just have a real really subtle effect something like point, 0.5 would be really good something that's noticeable but it doesn't make you sick if you want to it's just a bonus to this clip if you want to you can just get set scale set shake scale and then um, camera movement get velocity you have the velocity i'm not going to explain it completely split strike uh, plus then add all of them together and then just uh, multiply it by something like 0.1 and then this one should go into the event tick this will make sure that if the character is running or moving really fast, the camera will shake faster, this piece of code here. So you can just go, I mean, you can just control C, go into the event begin play, control V, and then connect this one right here. I'll show you how it works in a second. Oh, yeah. So you have to make sure this target is connected so i already you can just go ahead and right click promote it to a variable i already did um set this one's um that and then base shake should come in here and then if you are not moving the uh the shake isn't working but if you're moving the shake isn't moving either. Oh no, it it started working. So this is what we got. It's pretty intense, but at least we have something. At least it's something you can play around with. 
um, make sure you can, you play around a lot with this one make sure you don't have a lot of shaking your scene make sure not to make people sick that's pretty important uh, i hope it helped and if it did help please hit that like button and have a great day bye